Hey guys, this is Hannah. Um, I haven't done anything in a while, actually, uh, so I just decided I was going to do another book review. I think that's what I'm good for. I read a lot, so this is probably what this channel is going to be about. Book reviews. And scattered in there somewhere, there's going to be a few, like, concerts, crap and stuff. I don't know. See, you like, I just, I'm winging it, but I read a lot, so I'm going to do some book reviews. <sighs> Amazon.com, Place of Wonders place where you can look up anything and find something. Uh, I looked up something a little odd, um, and until I found it, I did not cease to stop searching for it. So I looked up Southern Gothic Romance Fantasy Novel, and I got Beautiful Creatures by Kami Garcia and Margaret Stoll. It's a collaboration. This is their first novel. And I'm gonna have to say that I was pretty impressed. Um, the book is, let's see how many pages. Do, 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 do. 563 pages long. Um, was it worth the read? Yeah, it was pretty good. I'm just going to tell you right off, it's not the best thing I've ever read, but it's definitely worth your time if you like things like this. Um, this book is about a very small town um, in the south, and uh, it's like this, this, okay, yeah, cliche. This girl moves to town, and she's so different than anybody else. And this southern... Um, educated, nice little jock boy named Ethan takes notice of this girl who is different than anyone else and <sighs> thinks she's so attractive and falls in love with her. Um, but uh, it actually, I, despite the fact that I got this book without really thinking about like the plot or anything, I'm being disappointed when I read the front flap a little bit when I got it. It was actually pretty good. Um, there's some twists in it that I did not expect. I'm not gonna lie. Um, there's some pretty cool things that involve lockets and casting, which is just a fancy word for being very witchy. I don't know. Um, but, uh, so... Uh, Big surprise, they fall in love, and a story ensues. A beautiful story. Ooh, go, go. Um, so, yeah. Beautiful Creatures. I do recommend it if you've got a lot of time. You see, I did it when I didn't have a lot of time and ended up wasting my time. Because, quite honestly, I couldn't put it down, hoping it would get better. But, um, I can definitely tell you that I will read the next one. And it says that the series is actually um, signed on for five books, which I don't know if I'm going to stick with it that long, but I know I'll read the second one out of interest of what happens. Um, all the books are supposedly going to evolve, evolve, evolve around Lena, which is the main female character's birthday. So, uh, yeah, that's my phone. Um, pick it up if you have time. <laughs> really, if you're really busy, don't pick it up. It's not worth not being productive. Um, yeah, let me just say, it's okay. Um, anyway, so that was Beautiful Creatures by Kami Garcia and Margaret Stoll. Uh, I enjoyed it only partially because of the fact that I grew up in a small southern town, even though I don't really sound like it. I grew up in a small southern town, so I could definitely relate to the main character. And that's the only reason I really kept reading it. Um, so, I hope this review was helpful. I'll show you the cover one more time. And... done.